Today's dish is all presented by Stone Academy, whether or not you're in the South, and assuming if you're watching, you're not, but you can celebrate National Mint Julep Day. It is today. The legendary drink is traditionally made with mint leaf, bourbon, sugar, and water, and the mint julep is long associated with the South and the Kentucky Derby. And in fact, 120,000 mint juleps were served at Churchill Downs. That's a lot. Are Wait, you a fan of a mint julep? Will I, you enjoy one on a summer day? I've never had one. Are you a bourbon drinker? I, I have had one, yes. I, I have had, had a few, maybe, bourbons, I guess, in, in my time. Yes. How, how, how about you? Are you uh, a no, no, I no. stick to clear liquors oh, okay. <laughs> as a rule. <laughs> now we know. If you invite her over to your barbecue, <laughs> Just saying. keep it clear. All right. A couple's marriage proposal is going viral because it's adorable. Yes. Take so a look. True. Becky McCabe brought a ring to the Memphis Zoo to propose to her girlfriend, Jessa. Which seems normal. Okay, so you're going to see she's going to drop down on one knee. But then when she did, Jessa there, she like broke out laughing hysterically. Why, you ask? Well, it turns out, you will see here, she pulls out of her purse her very own ring to propose <laughs> to her girlfriend. All at the same time, they both had the idea to say yes. Uh, at the same place, it has over 700,000 views online, and I think that is just the cutest thing you will see all day. So, so nice. I guess they were on the same page there, mm -hmm. right? Yep. All right, so chewing gum could have health benefits. Research, I heard that. That's a, oh, oh, me? Don't be a loud chewer. Sorry. Researchers found people expand, expend extra energy if they chew gum while walking. Especially older men. Especially older men. <laughs> yeah, those guys who chew with their mouth open. All right, it increases heart rates for both men and women and burns more calories for men. But chewing gum can help people lose weight, stimulate circulation, and oh, it's help cope my with stress. Kind of exercise. Let's just chew some gum. I, I Fresh I'm, breath to boot. Well, yeah, that's even Why better, <laughs> I guess, right? Why go to the gym when you can just throw in some juicy fruit and call it a day? I'm in. Simple, easy, right? <laughs> All right, moving on now. Have you seen this video, the real life Spider Man video? This it's is absolutely incredible. incredible. Yeah. Uh, the, the, a baby was saved. The baby was dangling from a balcony in France, yeah. and a man just jumped to the rescue. Take a look at this. So <laughs> it's, it's wild because he scaled four stories. Right like here. real life Spider Man. Just climbing the side there. Oh, my goodness. Uh, and he was able to reach the little boy and pull him to safety. It turns out the man was an undocumented uh, immigrant from Mali, uh, and he was. Made a French citizen oh, after making this big rescue. Wow, I'd say he's a hero, yeah. right? And he's also been offered a job by the Paris Fire Brigade, brigade which is even cooler. So it's, it's nice to see some heroic act there pay off for that gentleman. Oh there. my goodness, a or, happy ending there. So right? nice, yeah. All right, a simple gesture in one kindergarten class is going viral. So get this every morning, the five and six year olds in Texas start their day by lining mm -hmm. up and greeting one another with a handshake. Some hugs mm -hmm. and a smile. Why not? Aww, how cute is that? The teacher, Ashley <laughs> Colton Taylor, picks a different child every day to be the greeter. And she says starting the day with a friendly greeting will help each teach her students compassion Aww, and, and respect for one another. That is something I've never received from you walking into the studio. I always give you a big hello when no, I see you. It's always move out of the way of the mirror. I'm trying to do my makeup. You stand back <laughs> there. True. You're taller than me. Don't say that. Oh, no, I'm kidding. We, we <laughs> give hugs and high fives and, and all that. It's always a. A happy it's a happy place, right? Hey, speaking of a happy good old time, <laughs> this weekend you can experience Chicago, all the razzle and dazzle. It's one of the biggest musicals of all time. Yeah. Longest running on Broadway. It's won Oscars, uh, you name it, Grammys. They've, they've really Tonys. done it all. Tonys. <laughs> they've, they've done it. So this Friday you can experience Chicago during CT and style. And a night. big bonus because uh -oh. we are all going to be out there for opening night. Starts at 8. There are still some tickets available. Mm -hmm. We'd love to see you. Our good friend Megan Yost. Host is also going to be there, so you can go to SchubertCT.com and catch a great show. Yeah, and also that guy in the middle there, NFL legend Eddie George, he was a former big NFL right. star. Now he's like a Broadway guy, so it should be interesting. He's going to be on CT Style again on Friday, so make sure you tune in for that. Now, uh, we're, we're talking about clothing today. This yes. is a very unique uh, piece. You might have one or want one. This is a t shirt shirt. I'm confused by this story. All right. Tell me more, Ryan. So there's a new shirt for sale that's causing a lot of buzz on the internet, as you can see there. Uh, people are calling it ridiculous and presuming... why do you need that or well, want that? Because it's a t-shirt and then it has a shirt on top. They're basically sewn together, so you can wear the short sleeve shirt, so the other shirt drapes in front of you, or you can wear the long sleeve shirt and the t-shirt behind you like it a cape. It looks bizarre. I mean, a cape. Okay, oh, everyone wants a cape. I get that. This is thirteen hundred dollars. This is out of the book of Kanye, I think. I, I don't really know what's going on with that. I don't. I don't. 
don't get it. Unique, I guess. Do you want that? I mean, why don't you just wear your blazer on top of your shirt? That's how I look after idea. a wild night out. It's like, oh, wait, what, what garments are we wearing? Okay. Just combobulated. All right.